Hello friends, today I'm going to show you how to install custom ROM on your Micromax Unite 2 AX or J 4GB. First of all, you have to download the software and the driver from the given link. After you have when you have downloaded, you get three file. First of all, install MediaTek driver. Open it. Now go to where is the win file? <coughs> DP ins for 32 bit. If you have 32 bit installation, DP ins 64. If you have uh, 32 for 64 uh, bit uh, Windows. After installing it, wait. After installing it, then go to SP Plus 2 and extract port. Uh, extract port then. After extracting, you have got this Windows SP Plus 2. Open Plus 2. After which, you have to select from the electric. You won't. You have to select a boot file in the custom room folder. This is uh, the boot. Select catchy. Go to that and go to slow code. Get caro for catchy. Again, user data. Scaro the catcher. And from the update. After that, you have to click on download. After click on download, you have to switch off your phone and remove the battery first. After some, some seconds, insert the battery and connect your phone via USB cable, but please do not switch it on. Okay. Don't be panic, please be sure you have to install the driver properly and remove your battery for some seconds, just like 15 to 30 seconds. After that you have to insert the battery on your phone and please do not switch it on.
after some time it will take up to the downloading file is downloading and your phone will not be started please do not do uh, touch your phone while while downloading completing in the downloading process please do not turn on your phone you don't have get that errors which have you and seen it because i have just uh, doesn't uh, doesn't switch off the phone that's why that error was shown please turn off your phone before doing it and remove your battery the downloading will be completed within 3 minute 37 or 35 8 seconds 3 minute 33 seconds to complete flashing show you the speed how must how and is it being installed on your mobile your built phone can be correctly work after this you can repair your built mobile with it but do it at your own risk because it will remove your warranty period so please do it at your own risk <coughs> Sixty five percent completed. It will take lots my exactly some times, but because of some error, it will take that much time. When you have done it will be completed in three in a thirty three seconds. Three in a thirty three seconds. It will make your phone ready to use.
can see the downloading ok error it will show you correct right that means download is done after it you have to remove your USB cable from your computer then after seeing it then you have to press volume up volume down key and power up key together after that you have to reboot the, to the recovery mode you have to go to the recovery mode you have seen two options plus you have to press plus uh, volume plus button or go to recovery mode after you have to go to the recovery mode just press the menu, uh, power button to see the menu when the power button when you see the power when you see the menu you have to power down and go to the wipe data factor reset options and press menu key to ok press volume down key button to select yes delete all users data information then press menu key for ok after it you your phone will be formatted and then select reboot system select reboot system now option by clicking menu button after that your phone will be started and it will be correct and back to the their original custom room i hope you will enjoy this video please like uh, so please like it share it or subscribe it if like it like it and go to our blog for more updates it lollipop update will be uploaded very soon